what is happening here? Somebody gets a really nice breakfast this morning. <laughs> oh, cheese. <laughs> My bread is just covered in rocket. <laughs> I love rocket. My bread's covered in salami. <laughs> I'm not sure this is necessary, but I've now got four pairs of knitted socks <laughs> in my clothes bag. Is that overboard? I don't know. They're very comfy. Hello, good morning. Hello. Oh, nice. I like her bicycle. <laughs> dry is this dry no not at all but i think on a cold morning like this morning there's no chance we're going to get it dry before we leave so i think i'll just stuff it in oh look another pannier has been conveniently dropped outside the door for me <laughs> Where's my next piece? Baby. Jesus, that is a big baby. <laughs> Jesus. Cool. Thank you. You're welcome. <laughs> but really, this Moscow Moto gear is so easy to set up. Like the panniers, they're just. You know, clip down, tank bag, four clips, look at that. And there we go, Bumblebee's ready for an adventure. So yesterday we pumped up the tires, we greased up the chain. I'd say we were ready to go. I dried off my leather gloves and they feel so like tough now, you know, like really hard. Maybe we over dried them. Yeah. Okay, ready? Papa. Okay. Okay. Okay, <laughs> okay. Dokie. Wow. Nice. Hey, it started pretty easily, eh? That's the sound I like. Good job, Bumblebee. You never let us down, eh? We'll probably do. Oh, my uh, help. Wait. Oh, my visor. Oh. Oh, my visor has uh, come off. Oh no. <laughs> Hold on. Can you see? Oh, it snapped. Oh no. Oh no. That doesn't look really good, does it? Okay. Come to me. Yeah, you can't open it anymore. Okay. So I just leave it like that? Yeah. Okay. Ready? Good job I've got my pin lock. Otherwise, my screen would be completely fogged up. Okay. Ready? Yep. Luckily, we just have four rides more to go, so hopefully that won't be too much of a problem. <laughs> oh no. Good morning, world. Welcome back to our Guinness World Record attempt to become the youngest pair to circumnavigate the globe by motorcycle. We're here in Veluwemeer in the Netherlands, and we've been staying for the last two nights next to this beautiful lake here called Veluwemeer. Absolutely stunning here. Yeah, it's so, so beautiful. We have been actually invited by Kia and Marco to stay here at this water park. And the summer house was just absolutely incredible. We had such a good night of sleep and we could really rest and just have a little bit time for ourselves, which was very, very needed. Yeah, it was so super cozy so super chilled it had really like cabin in the woods by the lake vibes and yesterday we even went for a swim in the indoor pool that they have there oh it was so so nice it was so luxury for us really so luxury so thanks so much Kia and Marco for allowing us to stay there and this area around this holiday park is just so beautiful you've got this forest you've got this huge lake 
it's just been the nicest stay. Yeah, we have been really lucky because there is no rain today. The past two days it was pretty much raining non-stop. Yeah, we definitely picked the right day to continue our journey. Yeah. So we have just four rides left on our journey. Can you believe it? I absolutely can't believe it. So let me show you guys where we're headed. So we are here and over the next four days our plan is to ride through the Netherlands, into Belgium, across to France, over the channel to England, and on to our final destination, London. Today, we are aiming to reach the city of Eindhoven. Yes, today we're gonna to be making our way from the north of the Netherlands, where we are now, all the way to the south, to the city of Eindhoven, because after enjoying their summer house, we're now gonna be spending the evening with Kia and Marco, and then tomorrow, we're gonna to be riding together into Belgium. So it's about 100 miles to Eindhoven, and Google Maps says it will take us three hours. It's already 10 o'clock, so better hit the road, let's go. So I think this bit here is actually where we go under an aqueduct that connects the two sides of this lake, which I've seen pictures of. It looks absolutely amazing from the sky, but when you actually ride it... Yeah, aqueduct. There's not much going on. <laughs> So we just stopped here to take a look at this beautiful traditional windmill. Have a look at this. They have windmills like this all over the Netherlands. Such a quintessential Dutch thing. Look at that. I always find them so charming. And look, it's got a thatched roof here. And then this beautiful wooden staircase. Here's some information about it, but it's all in uh, Dutch. I guess 1403 is probably when it was constructed. Apparently the windmill is called Floris. Oh. That's what it says up there. Look, Den Olden Floris. Uh -huh. Very nice. It really looks like a crazy construction. It doesn't look like that it could hold itself up like this, you know? No, it looks like it's gonna fall any minute. Yeah, exactly. But I think it's been here for a long time. Yeah. The last time when we visited the Netherlands, we met actually a family who was living in a windmill. Do you remember? Yeah, yeah, at Kinderdijk. Yeah. Yeah, that was so cool. Amazing. It would be so cool to live inside one of these. I would love that. <laughs> and then you could have like free electricity as well. <laughs> what are you doing there? I need to dry off my bum. <laughs> You're drying off your butt on the engine. <laughs> Resourceful. It's so cold and it's really wet. And my visor's broken. It's pretty crazy here in the Netherlands because we are riding on a road which is just about big enough for two cars. Yeah, because they've got these two huge bicycle lanes. So there isn't even a line in the middle. You have to like, just sort of pull to the side when a car comes the other way. Yeah, super crazy. I guess it's quite nice as well, because then cars don't go too fast, hopefully. <laughs> there was a sign there that was like, D -d 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 mountain and it was like 69 meters above sea level. <laughs> I think we just reached the top of the pass. <laughs> That's like worthy for them to put a sign. I love it. We have reached the top of the pass. So it looks like we've come to another ferry crossing, <laughs> which, which we had no idea about. 
Surprise! <laughs> oh no! What funny. if we build some bridges here in the Netherlands? <laughs> Come on guys! Hey guys, I don't know if you've noticed us wearing these t-shirts before? Well, these are our Overlander tees and we're selling them on our Etsy store. We actually designed them ourselves, so you better like them. If you love what we do and want to show your support, why not buy one of these super cool tees? By doing so, you'll be helping us get a hot meal or a cozy air-conditioned room for the night. Head over to our Etsy store and order one today. We get it shipped out for you wherever you are in the world. Thanks, Mum and Dad. <laughs> you can find the link to the store in the description below. Thanks so much, guys. And now, back to the video. The ferry is coming. This is exciting, isn't it? It is. <laughs> we have traveled 44 miles in about two hours. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, we're just taking the nice scenic route today. Yeah. I put like the highest setting on the Garmin adventure routing. I was like, yes, take us the most adventurous way. <laughs> and for the Netherlands, this is the most adventurous way possible. It's like, oh, you want adventure? Here's a short ferry ride for you. Yes, for sure. Okay, that's us. Go where the kid goes. Yeah. Perfect. Yeah, we're on a boat. <laughs> <laughs> we're on a boat again. Oh, nice. Hello. 180. 180. How many trips do you do in one day? <laughs> don't count. <laughs> <laughs> Too many. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you. Oh, I, I missed an opportunity to say thank you well. <laughs> thank you well. Too hot met you. We on the water. We on the water. It's again like this pulling system, no? I think he's driving, but he's, he can't float downstream because he's ah. like anchored. The last pontoon is an anchor mm. and these two pontoons are holding up the cables and we're swinging okay. on an arm. This is great. Yes, I like the sound. This new battery is great. Yeah. And there we go. Adventure over for the morning. <laughs> Back on dry land after some time at sea. Not the most efficient way to travel across the Netherlands, but that was good fun. Five minutes later. Just going to go over this little bridge. Oh no, it's not a ferry, is it? Oh no, it's another ferry. Is it? I don't know. Oh no. No. Uh, uh, might be a bridge. I'd be surprised if it was a bridge, unfortunately. Yeah, I would be surprised as well. <laughs> I mean, this lo doesn't look like the kind of place that has a bridge. No. Oh no, oh no, oh no, let's see. <laughs> Yeah, it is a ferry. <laughs> oh no! Oh no! Hello! Hello! Hi! Can you shave the edge? How much? Uh, 270. 270. Ah, 270. Mm -hmm. Okay. Two? Yeah, three. 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 <laughs> Perfect. Oh, that's cool with all the change. Yeah. Yes. Cool, and thank you very well. yeah. okay. <laughs> Luckily, the ferry rides aren't that expensive here. <laughs> no, <laughs> not like our Russian ferry. No. <laughs> <laughs> that was like 2,000 pounds. <laughs> yeah. This one's like 270, please. Yeah, I wish to write it down. Because we are writing everything down, what we have spent on this trip. At the end of the trip, we will make a video and inform you all how much it costs to go one time around the world. 
Yeah, I can tell you it's a lot. <laughs> yes. But luckily we don't have any other responsibilities, hey? We don't have a house, we don't have any anything. So we have just us. We don't even have Bumblebee <laughs> because we have to give Bumblebee back when we finish the trip. So it's true. We uh, I just have this tank bag. I have this tank bag. And nobody can take it away from me. Oh, I think we're going. We're going. We're on the sea again. Oh, I do like to be beside the seaside. I do like to be beside the sea or on the river. Yeah, it's a real adventure to ride around the Netherlands. <laughs> yeah, I'm actually surprised. Yeah. I'm pleasantly surprised. Yeah. But I do think after this, it's time for us to find a place to have some lunch. Good idea. Thank you, Mr. Ferryman. <laughs> nice. There we go. There we go. The invention never stops here in the Netherlands. <laughs> oh, oh no. It's a... No, it's just a bridge. Oh, it's a bridge. But I think it's a bridge that lifts up. Oh, wow. You can see it's like on a swing arm. Yeah. I think people have to be very creative here with the bridges. Yeah, they got a lot of water. Yeah. Oh, that's cool. Look. A bridge you can lift up. There you go. Awesome. Thank you so much. Ooh, thank you. Thank you so much. Thank you. So here in the Netherlands, fries are really popular. So we said if we saw a place that did fries that we would get some, but then we got inside here and we saw that they had some veggie burgers. So we got two veggie burgers and fries. <laughs> a little bit overboard, but it's a cold day. So we needed a nice hot meal. Bon appétit! Bon appétit! Mm. There's nothing better than a good veggie burger. These trees are so close to the road. So close, man. And the roads are really tiny. Yeah, I mean, how easy it would be for a car to hit one of these trees. Yeah. Man. Yeah. You can see actually <coughs> where some of the trees have been hit. Oh my god. Okay, so we're nearly arriving at Kia and Marco's place. And I'm so glad that it hasn't rained today. Yeah, me too. I'm so thankful. Yeah, we had quite a lot of days of rain recently and uh, today didn't look amazing, but we stayed dry. Yes. So it's, it's actually been a really, really nice ride in the end. It was a lovely ride. Absolutely lovely ride. The Netherlands is so beautiful. It has such a beautiful countryside. I'm absolutely amazed. It's been a real Netherlands countryside adventure. I've really enjoyed it. Super chilled. Super nice. Yeah. Hey! <laughs> I won't, I'm trying not to run you over. <laughs> yes! We made it! Happy and alive! Happy and alive! Oh, nice to meet you. How are you? Hello! It's so relaxing so much in the summer house. Yes. Oh. I, the first day I was just sleeping. I was just in bed okay. the whole day. <laughs> oh, it was so comfortable. Oh, I, oh it's so happy today. Oh. I was like, uh, oh my god, I hope it's free, I hope it's free. And then he messages, sorry, it's oh, rented a whole month. I said, can we do something for him because I uh -huh. promised. Uh -huh. Yes, 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 we can give them the number 12. Number 12, and well. Like, okay, good. That's so cool. So nice. Oh, you have to write Netherlands on. Oh, oh yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. Yes. Um, oh, that would be a pleasure. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Let me see if there's a space. So Kia is going to do the honours of writing Netherlands on our box. Yay! We don't have a lot of space, so <laughs> we're having to do it like here. <laughs> yeah. Oh! Yeah, yeah. Netherlands! Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> nice. <laughs> Happy life! Yes! Happy life. <laughs> so what have we got here for dinner? Oh, beautiful. And a Moroccan salad oh, with bread. some bread. Yeah, and good it. company. And good company. <laughs> that is yes. amazing. Enjoy. Thank you so much. Thank you so much. <laughs> we have like the light on our power bank. 
and our head torch. <laughs> we're just trying to figure out what's the best lighting solution. <laughs> like this? I like this. <laughs> one, one in front of each of us. Okay. Good evening. Ooh. We made it happy and alive. Or are we dead? Good evening, guys. We made it happy and alive. Yes, and we are in bed. We had a beautiful Moroccan tagine dinner. Kia, you are a master chef. We really, really enjoyed this amazing meal. And we were just like talking away for hours and hours until the time where it's like, oh my God, it's 11 o'clock. We really have to go to bed now. <laughs> yeah, and we better say something to the camera to let them know we did make it happy and alive, which we did. It's definitely time to get to bed because tomorrow we're going to be riding with Kia and Marco over from the Netherlands to Belgium so it's going to be super awesome wow super crazy just three more rides and this journey will be over <laughs> yeah I don't think I'm going to believe it until we're actually there in London at the Ace Cafe in three rides Yes, and that is from us today. We hope you enjoyed the video. If so, please give us a thumbs up, subscribe to the channel, share the video with your friends and family, comment below, and we will see you next time. And thank you so much, Kia's son, for letting us stay tonight in your room. You have a really comfortable bed. <laughs>